to the envious. Uh, I always tell one thing that, uh, you know, sometimes we argue a lot with some people who are very argumentative or not ready to listen to us, who are very envious, who are very rebellious. So I always say that uh, there's no shortage of souls in India. <laughs> so there are always some people who are very receptive, ready to hear. So there is no point in you know arguing, arguing, arguing beyond a point. He's not ready to listen. You give your point, he gives another two points. You know, if a person, the greatest, uh, you cannot wake up a person who is pretending to sleep. They said. So a person is determined that he does not want to understand or accept. He's determined. No matter what you seek, what arguments you have, he'll not accept. So we, as a matter of duty, as you know, out of compassion, we try even such people. But beyond a point, we don't break our head because there's a lot of people to preach to. That is what I personally feel. We don't break our heads because there are a lot of people who are innocent, who are ready for this, who are waiting for this knowledge. There was once nice, uh, there was a book, a nice article which says that sometimes when we go as life membership preachers, we get fed up. Why is not giving? And uh, we see all kind of people. Some people will give very easily. Some people will not give. Some people will make you chase for a long time. And uh, you know, all kinds of mixes there. So as devotees, we should always remember there is one formula called SWSWSWSW. SW four times. What does this SW four times stands for? Whenever we distribute holy name, whenever we distribute prasadam, whenever we distribute uh, transcendent knowledge, whenever we go for preaching to collect money, we should always remember, first SW will means some will, some won't, somewhere someone is waiting. 